Is it loud enough in here, P. Diddy? Yep. Yo! What up, y'all? Welcome back to opening day of ducks, baby. Opening day of big, big time ducks here in Kansas. We're not in Alaska anymore, P. Diddy. I know, it's not. It feels good, though, to be back. got a sticker inside my hoodie. Yeah. Anyways, uh, Kansas, big duck opener. Four of us, uh, Devin, Evan, P. Diddy, myself. We are headed west an hour uh, to go hunt with Cameron and the Wing Chaser boys. You guys haven't seen them for a while. But uh, here we are in the lodge. It's empty, no clients. How'd you sleep last night? Uh, like Evan said, it was like Christmas Eve. <laughs> duck openers like Christmas yeah, Eve. Yeah. The boys can't sleep. Uh -uh. Got a little bit of the jitters and jives going on now. Yep. But uh, big duck, big duck opener. Uh, we have a cornfield. We don't. Cameron found a cornfield loaded with ducks, a ton of teal. Which, mind you, I have the cinnamon that one of y'all gave me that's already mounted. I need a green and a blue wing. Uh, to go on a log for my mount. So keep your eye open, P. Diddy, for a stud. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And secondly, uh, over at Ducks, all the gear is available, but we just re-upped with all of the new seasonings, all of the old seasonings, all the seasonings and duck calls are back in stock, y'all. Use code BOB at checkout to save some money. Uh, let's check this out real quick. This is... Uh Oh, this isn't a new mount, is it? This is the Ross mount. What are we going to do with this thing? It's just hanging out now. Well, there's still a spot over there, isn't there? Oh, yeah, we moved the fridge. All right, it's early. We're going to get on the road and to the quick shop. I need some caffeine. You guys will be along with us. <laughs> Getting her tuned up, huh? Getting something like that. <laughs> you having call troubles already? Yeah. The season hasn't even started, dog. This isn't technically my call anymore, but <laughs> not quite. Well, we got the boys chilling. It's uh, probably 15 minutes till shooting light and still very dark. Uh, here's the spread. We are on some sheet water. Well, we're in the blind. How long we got, boys? Six minutes. Six minutes. This is the situation. How many decoys you got out there? Three dozen. Two mojos. Uh, it's probably going to be an early shoot here, y'all. Not too certain you can see my face, uh, but it's going to be some early shooting. I hope it isn't dark. I'll probably film with the big camera uh, so we can make sure that we capture something here because it's going to be a lot of teal really early. Ooh, we got some landers right in front of us. Oh God. Oh, nice shot. Well, we got two or three down so far. <laughs> it is so dark. I got the big camera here. I hope y'all can see something. He's right behind that decoy. Yeah, you got a, oh, here's another one coming. Maybe. Uh, he's in the open now. Get him. Oh, the old Arkansas Thunder right there. Boy, howdy. Done it. We've done a lot of, uh... We've done a lot of water swatting. <laughs> How many have you killed on the water so far? Two? Two. <laughs> About the easiest way to get her done here. Uh, that has recently been a big debate if water swatting is ethical or not. And I will tell you, in my eyes, it's the most ethical way to shoot a duck. Um... You know, drop a comment down below. Let's hear your thoughts. Got another swimmer. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> nice. Oh, nice shooting. Nice, nice shooting, boy. Oh, get him. Oh, right in front, right in front. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nice shot. Shot. Well, there we go. Got to do some cleanup duties. 
Here. This is uh, the blind situation. We got two A-frames out here. Looking good. Looking real good, the old A-frame today. Literally out here just in some grass. Beautiful morning. Yeah. Oh, look at these in front. Oh my. That's a lot of birds. Single. I can't see it. Right there. Oh. Oh. Oh man, this is a big group of teal. Lots of teal today. Ooh, they're going to shortstop us out there. Oh yeah. Look at these getting in here. Woof, big flare job. Single. Oh! <laughs> he swore to me. Oh, he's down. Ready, Bob? Oh, yeah. Oh, my. Wow, that's a bunch of birds. That is a lot of teal. <laughs> On the left. It's getting wild, boys. That's a lot of teal. <laughs> well, it's time for me to shoot. I'm done filming. I can't resist it any longer. If you guys are liking the video, you know what to do. Smash the thumbs up button for your homie. Uh, we're gonna get to spraying, spraying and to praying here. He did. I didn't even. Nice shot. Still going up at him. No, that was not me on the water. That's all you down there. I didn't pull the trigger, boys. Oh shit. Oh. Nice. I didn't even see them. That's exactly. getting western. <laughs> what the? Out the back. Out the back. Out the side. Hey, on the left, coming. I don't know, but that was a high shot. Whoever did that, my goodness, out front. Oh, my goodness, look at that! You weren't kidding about the teal population, lordy, over the top. Hey, uh, boom. Oh, I just heard one land over here. Yeah, one landed right there. Out front, out too. Front, out front. Watch the dog. More on the left. Kill that one, Bob. Nice shot. Yeah, buddy. Another pair? Yep, I'm going to grab these. Oh, right here, Bob. Nope. Oh, it is getting wild. All right here, coming in, boys. Oh, my God. We got one on the water here on the left. Holy cow. Oh, my gosh. Look at these birds. <laughs> go down. He didn't go down. My goodness, that's a bunch of teal. Lord. Barrels are going to be hot after this one. Boy, howdy. Nice shot. Time to pick up. I got two birds over here. Right here somewhere is the one I dropped. Where are you at? Where are you at? Hey. Great. 
Up here, here, here. Nope, drink. Nope, nope, nope. Drink. Drink. Here, here, here. Drink. Drop it. That little bath. This is crazy. Teal, baby. Woo! What a shoot. We knew it was going to get wild right at the get go. And boy, howdy. I bet you we've seen. Oh, sh shooting at them as we're picking up. Holy cow. That's a lot of teal, boys. That's unreal. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, my God. Look at these teal coming. Holy cow. <laughs> nope. Okay. <laughs> We're all out here picking up birds. There's birds decoying. These are going to decoy. Oh, boy. Dude, he flew like right next to me. <laughs> We're standing on the beach shooting ducks. What in the so heck? Awesome. Tell me that wasn't some group of teal there. I have not seen that in so long. Crazy. Did you get it on the big camera that first uh, when we first saw it? I don't know. I started shooting at the wrong time, I think. Dude, that was awesome. Holy cow. Uh, the Wing Chaser boys, this is what they're best known for, guys. I'm not going to lie. If you want a Kansas duck hunt, like I have always preached, come with Wing Chaser. They got uh, all the sheet water you'd want. And uh, sheet water in Kansas, very prized possession, and they got a bunch of them. If you want duck hunts, this is where you need to come. Best duck hunts of my life have been with these guys. Oh, over the top. Oh! Behind oh! Me. Yeah, best duck hunts of our life have been with Wing Chaser. No lie. No lie. Wow. One out front coming in. Oh. Left side, right out. He did. Oh, look at that. <laughs> good shooting. Ah, uh, good shooting, boys. I didn't see him coming. Wow. <laughs> wow. Holy cow. So Cameron was saying uh, these birds don't roost on uh, the, any of the sheet water. Uh, they just come here their morning flight to get a drink, and boy, how do they come in big wads? I don't know how many till we've seen. How many till have we seen? You think? Um, a lot. <laughs> a few, couple thousand, at least. Oh, they're gonna get in here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh yeah. Ah, there we go. That was a long shooter. Oh, long wow. shooter McGavin One, there. Two, three, four, five, yep, we better six. pick up, boys. <laughs> That's pretty good. Yep. Holy smokes. What a beautiful morning. Goodness. Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. What a beautiful little water hole. Good enough. There's the last one I shot here. Didn't go in the water. See if it's a keeper or not. Ooh, that's a good looking greenie. Maybe a keeper. Ah. 
it's a beauty this morning. All green wing, dude. They're mostly all green wings. Have not seen a big duck yet. It is big duck opener. Haven't seen one. It's all teal. Good, eh? <laughs> oh yeah, unreal. Unbelievable, look at that. That's all it is, A-frame right on the water. Doesn't get no easier than that. Man, I love these till when they actually land on land and not in water. They don't get all nasty. Good looking bird. It's just loaded with teal out here. Tons of them. Well, I'm sure y'all are curious. Uh, this is what I'm shooting. Two and three quarter, uh, ounce and a quarter, four shot bismuth. Two and three quarters. They don't knock your shoulder very hard and they are perfect. I love them. Love them. Love them, love them. If you haven't tried bismuth and you're curious, I would say if you can afford it, try it. It is amazing stuff. Well, well, well. What a deal that was. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. All teal. Yep, all teal. Seen a few big ducks, but not very many. Yeah, not very many at all. But uh, that's called getting her done here. My goodness. What a pile that is. Woo, boy. Great, come on. Beautiful. Uh, lots of these hunts with uh, wing chaser. Uh, it's going to be sheet water like this. Farm ponds, sheet water, and just ducks galore. The flight line of ducks that wing chaser has out here, they're about an hour to hour and a half uh, west of me. So the amount of ducks that they get out here uh, trumps uh, the amount that we get at home. And uh, every time we come out here, always a banger duck hunt with the boys. I will... Uh, like always, whenever I hunt with Wing Chaser or anybody else, I always link their service down in the description. If you guys want to book a Kansas duck hunt, these are the guys you need to go with. And I really do promise you that. They got a whole lodge, awesome little setup. Come experience it. Ooh, it's the next morning and that's the north wind that I was talking about yesterday. Oh yeah, the north wind is here, baby. Uh, it was really cool uh, seeing the specs move in yesterday, uh, but we are in the lodge. Uh, migration season is upon us. Birds are moving. New birds are already coming into the area and a lot more to come. Uh, before we go here, I wanted to tell you all a couple things over at Ducks. We just did a huge, huge October, the first drop of October, and a lot of new things hit the ground running. Not only did we stock up on all of the duck seasonings, uh-huh, all three or four of them, yeah. But we also have uh, a lot of new product over there. We restocked the hats, I believe, the pullovers, a lot of new stuff. You need to go check it out. Plus, all of our duck and goose calls are all in stock and online for your purchase right now. So, I've got a lot of questions about the calls. Uh, this is my favorite year of ducks waterfowl calls. They're amazing. We have Delrin, acrylic, uh, double reed, single reed, a lot of different options, a lot of different price options. So head on over to duckswaterfowl.com and check it all out. Remember, if you guys buy anything at any time, use code Bob, B O B. You can share it with your friends and family. Uh, you can use it for Christmas, whatever you need to do. But duck season's here. Uh, the lodge. The lodge, almost done. Almost done. It seems like when I'd get one project done, another one would start. When I'd get that one done, I'd be like, well, well now I want to do that because we did that. Yeah. Uh, guide season starts basically November. Uh, all the boys will be here, all the new help, Bert the Cook, uh, everyone. So the Kansas hunts are back. We might be going to South Dakota for mallards again with flatland flyways. I'm not sure. Like I said earlier, guys, uh, if you guys want to come to Kansas for duck hunting, there is no better guide service to do duck hunting in Kansas with than Wing Chaser Outdoors. Uh, down in the description, I will link their website, their Instagram. Go over there and book with them. Extremely affordable and great guys. But subscribe if you haven't. Uh, the season is finally here, y'all. I mean, I don't know what else to say. I need to stop jabbering and get to work.
<sighs> because we got clients coming. But stay safe out there. I really hope you all are getting out there. Uh, if it's your first year of duck hunting, guys, do not go in deep water lakes, rivers alone. Uh, don't send the boat alone. Do not overload your little John boats in deep water, ice, whatever, ever. Just don't overload them. I've sunk one before, lost a bunch of stuff. Don't do it. It's very dangerous. People die every single year because of that. Please practice your safety. Uh, but until next time.